What's up, I suck six multiverse? Nick Price, you don't work here anymore. Get out of here. Hi ho everybody, Sammy McCauley back with episode 30 of I Suck Sticks, our big old season finale, Wrestlemania 2. Great show for ya, great card, let me run it down for ya. First off, yo, 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 fuck dog, that was some crazy ass title match I had last week. I had him beat, bro, rematch tonight, right, for the title champ right here. That sounds like a great idea, but instead you're gonna have the opening match with this guy. Mark what? Price, right here. This guy? Yeah. Oh. Okay, have fun. Uh, so where was I? Okay, uh, so that match is taking place. Oh, last week you saw I made the match. Dr. Unk, he's gonna take on... Dr. Unk! Dr. Unk! Dr. Unk! Dr. Unk! Dr. Unk! Dr. Unk's gonna take on Zeus McFly. He's not actually taking on Dr. Unk. Dr. Unk! Dr. Unk! Dr. Unk! Dr. Unk! Dr. Unk! Dr. Unk! No, again, Dr. Unk versus Zeus McFly. Dr. Unk can't take on himself. So, um, that's another match. Okay, what else do we have? Uh, then we have, uh... Um, and you got me! Oh. And you got nothing else to do with me, man. It's a good thing you... Dr. Unk! Oh, yeah, Dr. Unk! Yeah, 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 yeah. Dr. Unk! Dr. Unk! Dr. Unk! It's a good thing you beat me in that TLC match last week, just so you can put me in the world title match tonight with Psych. Here's the thing, I did beat you in that TLC match, and so I get to tell you when to wrestle. No! I get to tell you how to wrestle. No! And I get to tell you who to wrestle. No! And it's gonna be your partner, Caden Talbane. No! What? No! no! <laughs> and then, okay, 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 so we got three matches now, what else do we... Title match. Psych, of course, he's got to defend the championship. And do we have an opponent? Oh, shit. Drew, I, I was kind of counting on you. I mean, the big rematch, WrestleMania 2, you, you guys went to the double count out. This time, no count outs, no DQs. You guys are going to. And. Yeah, Dan, it's, uh, it's tough. Especially because. Let's do this, motherfucker! <laughs> okay, Drew Sarian, my man! That's okay, we got the title match. Drew Sarian versus Psych and no DQs, no countouts, and they're gonna have. Dan? What? What's up? What are you gonna do? Uh, well, I mean, I figured I'm, I'm just I'm doing my managing gig here, and I'm, I'm kind of making the matches. And I, I mean, four singles matches, that's a good show. I don't think we've ever had a show like that. I mean, or maybe we have. I don't know. Our best shows are like that. I know that. So I figured I, I'd sit this one out. Four singles matches is enough. Well, Dan, you know what? You are right. Four singles matches is good. But allow me to be your matchmaker, your booker, your baked goods maker. Oh, okay. I think, Dan, you took Psych to the limit on your title match. Well, that's true. He and I went to a limit, a draw. Nobody could determine who won that match. We both, neither of us won, neither of us lost. also true. And, you know, you did beat Scott. You beat the shit out of Scott in that TLC match. Shit did get beaten, that's true. So, my proposal to you, Daniel, tonight, the season finale of I Suck Stakes, WrestleMania 2, we got ourselves a three-way dance for that title. Three gentlemen wrestling around simultaneously in, in a ring? one ring. You got yourself a deal, my friend. How is that for a main event, WrestleMania 2? I mean, are you excited? I mean, I, hmm, I think, that's gotta be everyone, right? I think, that's everyone, right? I, I think that's everyone. Yeah, that's gotta be. Not quite. Let's go to the ring. What's up, I Sex Dicks Multiverse? It's me, your best buddy, Caden Talbane, or Mad Dog Mike Kerr, whatever you want, whatever you want to call me, it don't matter. But you know what? A lot of people have been asking me, hey, what'd you get at I Sex Dicks? You know what I got at I Sex Dicks? Exposure! That's right! Because after the season of I Sex Dicks, I am going to focus on my mixed martial arts career. Oh, yeah, that's right. And with all that exposure, I made some connections. That's right. I'm going to... Oh, oh, there's just so many guys out there I want to beat the hell out of, like, like, like Andy Hoog, yeah, yeah, him, and, uh, uh, Evan Tanner, that's right, and, uh, Hideo Gracie, oh, I'm gonna murder those guys, you have no idea, oh, it's gonna be a bloodbath, that's right, and I got, with, with, with all that exposure I got, I made some really good connections, and I'm, I'm working with my boys, Mark Hunt, Help me whip my thing up. That's right. And I'm lifting weights with Phil Baroni. That's right. And I'm working on my ground game with Tank Abbott. Oh, it's going great. That's right. And, uh, uh, oh, also, too, 
man, I'm gonna get inside their minds so bad because I've made friends with the fight professor, Stephen Quachos. That's right, or as I like to call him, 1-800-TIPS. That's right, so here we go, baby. I'm taking you all on. It don't matter. Gracie, Hook, Tanner, I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you! What do you mean they're all dead? What did I get out of Ice Sucks Dicks? Um, title belt, obviously. You know, full-time champion. Everybody couldn't even stand a chance. All right, um, what else did I get out of Ice Sucks Dicks? I got to see Scott powerbombed on a fucking glass printer. That was boss. Uh, Jumped over the top rope multiple times, no hands attached, you know, that was boss. Overall, thought it was a good time, you know, it was nice to come back after doing fucking BCW for so long, come back and get a last final shot at everybody and really, you know, show them that they couldn't take me, is really what I was going for, but in the end, you know, I'll miss it, it was a great time, we did Fucking, I'm glad we did it. That's what I got out of it. So. Chewie, is it seriously as loud as you go <laughs> yeah, what happened to you? Whoa! Shirt and tie!
kicked it. You know what I got? I got an extra year and a half to wrestle that I didn't think I would. You know, I stood in this very spot. Well, not this very spot, somewhere entirely different, but in front of a camera six years ago at VCW's 200th show. And I said, jokingly at the time, I hope we do another 200. But you know what? Between all of VCW, which went damn near 350, and all the ISX 6 savings, I think we did do 400, which is god damn amazing. And I will put that up against anyone else's body of work out there. But you know what else I got? And more importantly than all that, all the shows, all the numbers we put up, all the ratings, all the accomplishments, I finally got in I Sucks Dicks to be me. Me! Me! Because some guy named Alan Creasy very early on came along and set me straight. And I was lucky enough to meet up with a young werewolf named Caden Talbane, not Special K, that's a slave name, and don't you bastards ever call him that again. And we got to wreak havoc on I Suck Sticks. And it's good one person got me, because Lord knows nobody else did. Yakuza J, maybe if he'd opened his eyes a little wider, he would have seen me for who I am, but he didn't. He was a horrible partner, he was a piece of garbage, and I hope I never see him again. But with me and Ken Caden Talbane at the forefront, at the vanguard of interspecies rights, the, the Chinaman was no longer on the railroad. The Negro is no longer in slavery, and with everything we're doing, despite the best efforts of you sons of bitches out there, with everything we're doing for interspecies rights, it's not going to be too long before we see a centaur president. Yeah, you know, it was, uh, it was a good season. Uh, team, uh, team played good. You know, a lot of good games. Got a lot of good wins. Uh, you know, it was a lot of... Uh, a lot of hard work, a lot of the whole team, uh, we worked together as a team, you know, uh, Coach did a really good job, he's, uh, you know, got some, some good young talent out there, uh, good, good Canadian kids, you know, uh, you know, make some good passes, put, put the pucks in the nets, uh, you know, just, just, just get 100%, you know, it's every game, go out there and skate and uh, get a good sweat on, just, uh, just, uh, what, what are you doing? Uh, I, 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 champion. He hails from downtown Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada, right near the beach. 
Match is over. Whoa! He's got a cone. Don't sit on it. What? No. What? Don't no. Sit on it. What? No. No. What? 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 No. What did I get out of I suck sticks? I'll tell you what I didn't get out of I suck sticks. No, no, no. I, it's, it's the question is not what didn't you get. It's what did you get? It. It says right there. Ah, ah. Words everywhere. All right. It's fucked. All right. I'll tell you what I didn't get out of I suck sticks. Hey, words. Gone? Gone? Good. All right, I'll tell you what I didn't get out of I Suck Sucks. I didn't get my dick sucked. <sighs> what did I get out of I Suck Sticks? You're gonna love this. Just before the show started, I Suck Sticks' lawyers handed me a contract. And in the contract was $60,000 for working those shows for that year, and a nice apartment down by the beach with the rent paid for. Well, it seems like a certain chief executive officer and whatever baked goods, I don't know, decided to get an extra set of keys cut. So the other day, you know what happened? I woke up in the middle of the night with Daniel Macabe blowing a load in my face. I quit! <laughs> Good. <laughs> <laughs> A former two-time BCW Canadian Champion, a former BXCW Quadruple Crown Champion, former ESW World Heavyweight Champion, and the only former I Sucks Dicks Champion of Men in Fighting and Grappling. He weighs in tonight at 183 pounds from Coquitlam, British Columbia, Canada, Caden Talbot! 
Bruce Scott. He is a former three-time BCW Triple Crown Champion, a former ESW Triple Crown Champion, former ESW World Heavyweight Champion. He hails from the handsome boy modeling school by way of the res in Vancouver, British Columbia, Canada, and weighs in tonight at 222 pounds. Two, 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 two. Two. Hey, 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 read the addendum. Oh, I, I'm sorry? Weighing in tonight at a slim, trim, lean, mean, buff, cut, ripped, chiseled, and jacked, 221 pounds. Atkins, 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 Atkins. The big cat, Scott Henson. Now nah, you've done it. You've done it now. <laughs> hey! I'm the guy, Yep. Yep. Oh. Yep. Oh. 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 Oh no! 
Oh, oh. What? 
Uh oh. There's a two! K! Twelve! What? That's, that's now! That's what we're going for! What? Never going to be Question again? Well, it's it's already on the screen, but it's what did you get out of Isaac's dicks? What did I get out of Isaac's dicks? More like what did they get out of me? They got me shirtless, throwing dudes around, picking them up over my head, fucking winning almost every match I've been in. Just a champion in the ring, through and through. I'm the best. And uh, what did I get out of Isaac's dicks? A couple of sore backs, a fucking few massages, a hand job in the back, a blow job in the front, and a couple diseases. That's what I got out of Isaac's dicks. Peace out. Frankly, I'm upset at being reduced to a simple catchphrase, and overall, I'm unhappy with the direction my character has been taken. I will not be redoing my contract for the second season. Good day.
British Columbia, Canada, yeah. ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Beer, Drew Stereo! <laughs> Weighing in tonight at 195 pounds, he is the only former four-time BCW Triple Crown Champion. He is a former two-time BCW Canadian Champion, a former WSW World Champion, and a former ESW World Heavyweight Champion. He hails from New Westminster, British Columbia, Canada. We'll he is the Wizard of Queen's Park, the <laughs> sensational, intelligent, Daniel Montgomery! The defending champion, weighing in tonight at 164 pounds. He is a former two-time VCW Canadian champion. More importantly, he is the current I Sucks Dicks champion of men fighting and grappling with seven successful defenses under his belt, and he has been champion for 11 months. Ladies and gentlemen, Sam! Ladies and gentlemen, this is your I Suck Sticks season finale main event.
Well, Last Sex Dicks Multiverse, that was a fantastic first season, wasn't it? It was so eventful. We had, uh, we had myself and Claire going and defeating Siler. We, we found this wonderful hatch, this glowing light coming out of it, you know? And we found this laboratory that had the cure to the zombie disease, but it blew up! Oh, we were so close to finding that cure. But you know what? In spite of all the things that have happened in the first season, thank God for the hero clause in my first season contract. I got to come and save the day. I got to rescue the damsel in distress. I got to save Daniel Maccabe and Drew Sarian. We all flew away together in a hall, this wonderful happy land. It was great. And you know what? That's what I got out of Isaac's Dicks. I got new friends. So good night and good luck. And thank you. I Suck Sticks Multiverse. Thank you very much for sticking around all this time. Episode 30, our season finale, was a great success, if I do say so myself. I am Daniel Makabe, and what did I get out of I Suck Sticks? Let me tell you. I mean, I got to be the face of I Suck Sticks, as I served you as the Chief Executive Officer of Matchmaking and Baked Goods. In addition to making the matches, baking the goods, I got to be the face of I Suck Sticks. I was the person you trusted more than anyone to deliver the news at 6 o'clock every night or give you a new episode every few weeks, something like that. The most trusted person in I Sucks Dicks, the face of I Sucks Dicks, that's pretty impressive, you know, I, I, and I sincerely thank you for allowing me to do so. You know, it wasn't always easy organizing shows, it wasn't always easy to get everyone's spirits up and, and keep it going, but I feel like we turned in a pretty good body of work over the last 30 episodes, last year and a half or so. Really, that's what I got out of I Sucks Dicks. And then, of course, there was the fact that, you know, after all that layoff, I got to come back to the ring and do really, let's not kid ourselves, what I do best. I mean, there was that time I took on uh, Scott Henson and Caden Talbain with the Axe of Jade. That was a good match. I think I won that. Probably. Yeah, no, I won that. And then uh, I took on those Australian guys. I think there was Ty, and then there was Brinks. I probably won both of those, or one. I don't remember. And then there's a time I, I, I beat Psych. I pinned him in like five minutes. That's pretty impressive. And then I think I got a count-out win over Mercury. That was good, too. And then uh, I faced Sonic again. And then I think I faced Chris Mason. And then Zeus McFly. I had a match with Henson in there somewhere. Uh, maybe another tag match. I mean, I really, really <sighs> Oh no, was that me? Oh, oh no, but I'm not, but that... It's just that I need you! What? What? What's wrong? What? Was it all a dream? Was what a dream? I sucks dicks. Whoa, 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 I think we all knew, but I didn't want to know. No, 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 not that. I suck sticks, the wrestling promotion. Wrestling promotion? You mean VCW? So that means... No, not... So it was all a dream? Think again. Justin, could you could you come in, please? Dan, yeah. you okay? What's going on? Scott, Dan's being a weirdo again. I'm coming. What's going on? What, what was it? A dream? No. Was it all a dream? It, it, it couldn't have been. What you talking about, Dan? I sucks dicks. You think you're actually gonna tell us? Dan, let me save you the trouble. We know. No, no, no. No, I sucks dicks. The wrestling promotion. Wrestling promotion? Our VCW is our wrestling promotion. 
But, but I, I, I swore. But, uh, I mean, what about Caden Talbane? Talbane? Isn't that from a video game? It's not from a fucking video game. I mean, uh, um, okay, um, Dr. Unk. Dr. Unk, Luke's weirdo friend? We haven't seen that guy in years. I'm pretty sure I saw him last week. Uh, okay, um, okay, Wade. Wade. He had the title for like almost a year, and he was super reliable, and, and just a really good dude. Wade is a shithead, and, and he's, he's never, never winning, winning the, the title. title. But that... I guess... I guess it was a dream? I mean, I really... Uh, uh, what day is it? It's July 27th. And... Well, what year is it? It's 2009, dummy. Yeah, yesterday was the last BCW show. I stayed over. That's why I'm at your guy's apartment. You know, we're going to England in a few days. It's Heat Fest, and uh, you should probably get your shit together. Yeah, step your game up. I guess it was all a dream then. Hmm. Okay, Heat Fest, here we come. Dan and his dreams. Whatever. Could have sworn. I suck sticks. What a weird name.